Hello everyone, I hope you're all doing very well. So for today's exciting viewer requested question from, um, sorry but I didn't get your name, from Air, uh, regards Air Force One, is it possible to replicate this scene from Air Force One? And we've got a scene, stand by. Oh, it's MiG-29. <laughs> That's a real radar! They gotta catch up with the MiGs. That's a real F-15 radar, I Oh, they're in Kazakhstan. Oh, I don't know. I guess they're at the bottom for some reason. Sir, we've lost countermeasures. I'm going in. Oh, no! Boom! I think I was thinking of the wrong movie. <laughs> We're clear! Yes! Go, Richter. That was actually a pretty cool scene. The music was awesome and everything like that. I mean, it's a little bit silly. I don't see why the MiGs would come in in a four-ship in formation and, you know, it's kind of a Grim Reapers attack. They come in in a four-ship formation and use yeah. terrible gun aiming and stuff like that. Um, in terms of recreation, I think the main thing in there was uh, this bit. Uh, was the, the thing that's going to be exciting. That was the interesting bit. A bit again, completely stupid, I reckon, but uh, very Hollywood. But cool. So, if a MiG fires at the rear of a large jet, can a fighter sacrifice himself by getting in the way? So let's think about the the basic physics of it. Uh, can you see the missile? Yes, you can. Being a Russian missile, it will be smoked. Will the, physically the missile explode if it you know it gets near or hits a target that? It is not the designated target. Yes, it will. So once that missile has got further enough away from the MiG in terms of time, it will fuse itself. At that point, its sensor, its fuse sensors are going, which are going to be radio, laser, whatever, which are kind of shining out in all directions, uh, kind of omnidirectional uh, in a ring around it, if you like. And pretty much, if anything gets in that ring of sense, then it will detonate. It doesn't have to be the plane that it was actually aiming for. So if we can get that F-15 close enough to that missile, technically that should work, I think. Is DCS going to allow us to model that? Absolutely no idea, but I guess it's worth a go. Okay, yeah, I see it. It's a... Oh, it's just another Hollywood bullshit missile. That's not a real missile. <laughs> they tend, they're making them all fat yeah. like Mavericks. Uh, kind of look fat and evil Darth Vader missiles. I don't see why they can't just put an R-77 in there. It looks perfectly evil. Yeah, so it's just a bullshit missile, so we'll just make up whatever missile we want. Notice how it changes course a little bit as the F-15 comes up, almost like it's sort of changing its track. Um... That wouldn't happen, but there you can see it exploding there. It's a really cool explosion effect. Okay, here's what we're going to do then. We're going to do one. We're going to replay the real event. We're going to start from the fact that the MiGs are just behind or in gun range of the 747, and we're going to come in in a group of F-15s for an afterburner merge, and you're going to see how it would really go. It wouldn't go anything like that because real life is not Hollywood. The reality is the MiGs would just shoot that plane down in a fraction of a second and then probably shoot us down, but we'll see how it goes. Next, can we gun the plane from a MiG and gun really stupidly and badly? Yes, we will cer almost certainly we'll be able to. Three, can we, s the, the interesting one, and the money maker, can we actually stop that missile once it's been fired? So we're going to see how that goes. Stand by. Is our 747 heading due south at 400 knots ground speed at Angel 16? Behind it are four times MiGs controlled by AI with high skill with as close as we can get the same weapons loadout as they had in the video. We are starting one in gun range at one mile, three others in relatively close, close trail formation at two miles as was roughly shown in the movie and five miles ahead on a convergent course is our good guys f-15s a flight of four in close formation with burners on and two of them will be myself and rc and the other two will be ai set to excellent skill level and we're going to see if we can intercept these migs before they shoot our guy down Almost certainly we won't be able to, but let's see, he'll see what happened. Stand by. Okay, we're in four times F-15C heavily armed eagles. This is myself. This is RC. This is Patterson. This is Peterson. If we look ahead, we can see Air Force One, Ivan, and his three cohorts. Go. Radar on. Missiles armed. Okay, I'm good. Track. Oh. Hostile. Shoot. It's pretty Cap. fired. Oh, look at that shit! <laughs> I got missiles going out. Oh, I went for the wrong guy. I went for the goddamn cap engaging. 
Cap, Fox 2. Low. One down, one down. Guns, guns, guns. Ah, I'm down. I'm god damn. God damn it. Oh, Harrison Ford is not doing well. Oh, no, they're going down. <laughs> Who's winning, the MiGs or the F-15s? I don't know, I'm still up. In the face! Beautiful. Are you high or right orbit, I'll see. Right missile, 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 missile. There's an Ivan up on your lift vector. Hi. Hi, missile the URC, missile the URC. Oh. Evade, evade, evade. Damn! Oh. There's one eagle left, there's one eagle left. Ivan's on him. And merge. Dogfight. That Widowmaker's gonna outturn him. He's outturning him, Marcy, he's outturning him. Oh, he's gonna let a missile go right here. Merge. No, he's too close for the missile. Merge. 50 might get a shot here. Death spiral. It just turns so much better. Air support still flying. How's Air Force One doing, RC? It's banged up, but it's banged up and going. Flying. Well done, Harrison Ford. We can make this. They've got a lot of problems. Air Force One's doing all right. Oh, we even took the same engine off that Harrison Ford did. How oh, cool! Go F-15, go! We believe in thou. Oh, that's a solution, that's a solution. I think, right? I don't know why the MiG won't fire. Got him right, look how much has burnt that energy right off that F-15. Come on, shoot him, shoot him. Probably on his six. Oh. He's only going one way, RC. Maybe as a conscientious objector, RC. I don't know. Oh, wait. Gonna get in big trouble. Well, I, I don't think these guys are just gonna twiddle around each other until they run out of gas. So we'll call yep. that a draw for the fighters. And Air Force One, amazingly. Oh, it's going down, RC! It's lost power. Oh, no. oh Harrison Ford! <laughs> Harrison Ford, you were always only my hero. Wait, there's only one engine broken. You were always for me. Come on. It's going down. No, he's found a runway look. Yes, Harrison Ford. Oh, yeah. Oh, you're my hero. Let me go check on the fighters. They're still dogfighting. <laughs> they just don't want to end the their AI life. Physics going they're, they're just flirting with each other. One Harrison Ford. We believe in thou. Yeah, yeah. Oh, oh, no. Harrison Ford! Harrison he's Ford! He's going in. Why? Oh, I saw his parachute. I saw his parachute. There was one shoot, I'll see. There was one shoot. Harrison, where are you? So close. He's worth so much money. And my heart bleeds. Well. Uh, that was disappointing. so close. I take it back. If we really, really was attacking over Kazakhstan and four MiG-29s did attack and we had four F-15s, then three F-15s and three MiG-29s would die. Two would just be flirting with each other, like a couple of pansies, just not shooting each other. <laughs> Harrison Ford would almost spectacularly, romantically, and effectively make it to a runway, but sadly half a mile out, fall into the water, eject, and then drown in his parachute. How does that make you feel, RC? That's... That's a sad state of That's affairs. That's a sad state of affairs right there. Okay, welcome back, valued viewers. Myself and RC are now the aggressors in the MiG-29s. We're going to go in and show that we can gun really badly on the aircraft. I'm going to bank in from high left and shoot down on that uh, in a starboard engine, and then you can gun when I say. Three, two, one, go. 
Oh no, there is a MiG that is approaching the Air Force One. Whatever will I do? Well, I'm going to get him on the starboard wing and then you can come and polish him off. <laughs> I missed him. Ha <laughs> ha, bugger. Well, it turns out it's not possible. Or at least let me hit that engine, that one engine that I want to hit. Come on, Harrison. Be a good boy. Woo! Okay, I'll see you come in and finish, finish this mother off. Is he going down? Yep. Wow, well, he's doing evasive. I see bullets. I hit him with your bullets. Don't miss. You're missing still, uh -oh. I'll see. I'm going to miss him. <laughs> uh, you know what, I'll see. This is where you're not getting the pay rise. Right, I'll do it myself. Stand by. <laughs> I was going too fast. You're going too fast, I'll see. Damn plane. Watch this. Fast. Get some. Get some. Oh, took his ailer run off. Ah, I can't get his engines. God damn it! Harrison died. Oh, he's lost his vertical stab. Oh, <laughs> get some. That's not gonna it's be a free for all, Lassie. It's a free for all. Vultures are moving in. Harrison Ford. Harrison Ford. He's going for an emergency landing. Oh, I wing clipped him. I wing clipped the mother. Come on, Harrison. Woo! Going down with him. I'm going down with him, RC. Get some! Oh, hit him in the mid-air. <laughs> okay, RC is now going to shoot a missile at the president. I'm going to try and interdict that missile with my face. Okay, we've had a change of roles. Uh, wait for it. Three, two, one, go. Oh no, Ivan is locking the house forward. Ready when you are. And fire. Fox 2. Evans, don't intercept my missile. Oh, <laughs> so unlucky. Let's try again. Stand by. <laughs> Fox 2. Go for that smoke. Go for that smoke. Ah, oh, you know, way too late. Right. Um, let's try that again. Fox 2. And splash. Five seconds too late again. Yeah. Okay, Valley viewers, we've done about, I don't know, 20 goes now, and this is just its not going to come together. So what we're going to try now is have RC sitting in between myself and the uh, uh, Air Force One in the same direction and see if it can kind of um, confuse the missile. I think that's the best we're going to get. Okay, RC, just full in formation right. right behind him and right in the line of fire. Launch authorized. Ba -ba right. Probably it's best if you're quite close behind him, a couple hundred feet behind him. And hold. And Fox 2, with RC in the way. This is warning. Who's it gonna kill? Who's it gonna kill? Who'd he get? Who'd he get? Oh, hit me. Hey! You saved Harrison <laughs> Ford, RC! How does it feel to be a hero? There we go. Yeah. Feels great. Yeah, I'm glad, I'm glad. <laughs> right, don't forget to punch out, that's gonna be a hard landing. So, we've shown that, let's just pause that right there, that uh, Harrison Ford cannot escape a MiG attack in identical scenarios apart from it being light, and that was just for the camera so you could see. Yes, a MiG can gun really awfully at a uh, 747 equivalent, and no, you can't intercept front ways. Yes, physically it is possible, but the chances of doing it, I reckon, are a million to one, being in that place at that time with that closure rate. Uh, and but you can block it from the kind of behind because it will get confused and go for the wrong engine uh, or it might just be that it's uh, close enough to the proximity fuse anything you want to add to that rc nope i hope you enjoyed that see you later